Well, a neighborhood in Portsmouth is a food desert no more. Today, the Farm Fresh in the Victory Crossing Shopping Center has reopened. And I hear you can smell the chicken from outside. We reported back in March, 21 Farm Fresh stores were sold to Kroger, Harris Teeter, and Food Lion. Since then, independent local grocers stepped in to revive three Farm Fresh stores, including the one in Portsmouth. Now, 10 on your side's Aisha Tolliver was there as people got in line for some of that famous fried chicken. Aisha. Oh yeah, Anita, almost everyone I talked to was either standing in line for the fried chicken or already had it in their cart. It was a very exciting day for people here in Portsmouth who tell me they got their grocery store back. The lines didn't seem to stop at this grocery store in Portsmouth. Yeah, fried day. There weren't any extraordinary sales, but customers couldn't wait to hit the shelves. Close to convenient, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, more can I say? And the, and the chicken is great. Prices is great. It's a community favorite that had just been brought back to life. I mean, it's just a local brand that everybody is, used, is so used to. I mean, they grew up with, with the brand. This Farm Fresh isn't necessarily a new grocery store. The location closed its doors back in May after Kroger and Food Lion purchased the store from Super Value Inc. But owner Chris Lee purchased it back and revived it. I mean, it was a good opportunity. I'm, I mean, everybody was asking me to open the store, so decide to just go ahead and open it. And the employees are familiar faces. Most of them actually have worked at this store. Uh, so yeah, I mean, a lot of the customers already recognize all the people. And while the shoppers were excited to get their necessities from a place they know and love, it was clear many were there for one thing. What's your name, sir? A.P. Smith. This is the best chicken. This is the best chicken we got and everybody's happy it's come back. It's very good. I love it. It's worth waiting in this line? Yes, ma'am. The line of people who were deprived of the farm fresh fried chicken wrapped into the produce section. Lee says it was a no-brainer to bring it back. It would have been crazy uh, without that fried chicken. Uh, they'd probably be here strangling me right now. <laughs> Well, Lee says it'll take some time before he'll know if the investment's paid off, but he says all the thanks from the community is what matters most. Take a look at the line already now again this evening for that fried chicken. In Portsmouth, I'm Aisha Tolliver, 10 on your side.